everybody, it's me, Kristen. I was just reading some old YouTube comments and I just thought, wow, I'm so lucky that I've got to know so many wonderful people through YouTube and Facebook and online over the years. And I'm just so grateful. Um, you know, with everything going on in the world right now, with the um, virus and everything, sometimes I get kind of down and I feel like, oh, this is like a runaway train or a plane crashing and maybe it is but I hope not <laughs> I hope things will get better and right now I'm just feeling so grateful that um, I have all you friends out there um, and my family here and I'm not sick I'm glad for that um, and I'm glad, I was thinking about, um, uh, sorry, I just drank some pop, <laughs> and I'm like burping, <laughs> anyway, um, I was thinking that, um, I'm so fortunate that medications have helped me so much to be able to live with this mental illness that I know is so devastating for so many people. And um, I'm so glad that I've been able to talk about my life living with mental illness on YouTube um, and been able to share with people. Um, it's really meant a lot to me and to hear other people's stories and everything. So yeah, I'm just feeling really grateful at the moment and I I really am just hoping things don't get worse and hope they can find a cure for this virus. It's, I feel so bad for the people who are sick and dying and I know it's hard for people to stay home. Um, it's hard to comprehend the enormity of the situation, I think. It's like a global pandemic and it's just wow it's like it's hard to wrap your head around you know um but you know at different moments i feel different things sometimes i feel overwhelmed and depressed and like hopeless for the future and but at this moment i feel really grateful that i have everything i need and um, everyone I know is okay, and we're hanging in there, and I'm glad I got my medication yesterday. I almost didn't get it because I get a shot once every three weeks, um, you know, and so I went to the doctor yesterday to get the shot, and my temperature was 99 degrees, and they were thinking about not letting me in, and I was like, no! <laughs> So I said, I'm always hot. <laughs> um, so luckily I got my injection and, you know, I can get my medications, which is good. So um, I'm not like one of those people who says, you know, you must count your blessings and never be sad. Because <laughs> um, I know that sometimes it's overwhelming and depressing and anxiety producing and everything like that so I'm but at this moment I'm just grateful for everything I have for everyone I know is okay that I'm able to do stuff um, breathe because <laughs> I get I get scared thinking about what could happen I have to, have to try not to think about it too much but you know it pops in my brain but I've been making masks today, so like this one, this one I made for myself. Um, it's hard to hold the computer and um, let's see if I can do this. There we go. So, ah! My ears are kind of not very strong, so 
Anyway, here's a little mask I made. And I'm making these for people. I have so many to make. But I just made like 11 today. That was like a record for me. I know other people can make them faster, but <laughs> I'm really slow. But I'm making as many as I can for as many people as I can. And um, it's keeping my mind off things. Because, you know, you just like laser focus on the sewing and you don't really think about anything else. You're just like, oh, I hope I don't sew my finger to the, <laughs> to the mask or something, you know, or like, oh, can I sew in a straight line? I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, you'll see, if you see any of my masks, you know, I cannot sew in a straight line sometimes. <laughs> so anyway, they're not the most high quality masks, <laughs> but they work so hopefully they'll be helpful to some people anyway I hope you guys are doing okay out there try to remember that that I don't know that you'll feel better you'll feel worse you'll feel better again that it's it's an ever-changing situation and just hang in there and we'll get through this together so thank you for being my friend and I'll talk to you guys later bye